Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toyota located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this 2016 Chevrolet Silverado 1500 True North. Now the most notable features on this True North is its heated front seats. You have your backup camera along with your hard tonneau cover. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this 2016 Chevrolet Silverado 1500 True North. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this 1500 is its daytime running lights. And then you also have, if you take a look just down below there, your front tow hooks. And over on the side, you have your 18 inch aluminum alloy wheels. You also have your running boards. Up top, you have your foldable mirrors. And the color we're gonna be taking a look at today is black. Now, taking a closer look at the front dash as well as the front seats, you have your black leather interior seat surfaces. And as you can see, you have your power driver seat with lumbar support. Over on your left hand side, you're going to see your 4x4 select trailer brake. You also have your light controls located down below. On the inside of your driver's side door, you have your mirror controls, window locks, power locks, window controls, both your front and rear windows. Now, taking a look at some of the controls on your steering wheel, you have your cruise control as well as your voice recognition, Bluetooth, and your scroll function for your multi-informational display. Now, if you take a look at the multi-informational display, you'll see a couple of different features on here. So as you can see, you can go through your audio control on here, and if you actually scroll through some more, you'll be able to see a couple of other additional features, which include your info, phone, and options menu, and then you also have a digital compass on here as well, now, taking a closer look just at the uh, sorry, your, uh, center dash here, as well as your um, touch panel display, you have a couple of different features, which include that exterior temperature gauge and digital clock. As you can see with your menu screen, you have your audio phone, as well as your settings menu, and a couple of other additional features. Audio controls, as well as your temperature controls, just located down below for the dual zone climate control, and your heated seat controls for your driver and passenger will be located on either side. Now you have your traction control on and off. And taking a look just at the top here, you have your OnStar availability up on your rear view mirror. And I'm just gonna show you what the back camera looks like. So I'm just gonna start this up here. So as you can see with the guiding lines in there, it makes things a little bit easier for you when you back into a stall, but you also have the guiding lines as well. So depending on which way you turn your steering wheel, the lines will go in that direction as well, just to make things a little bit easier for you when you're uh, hooking up or uh, going into a stall. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo bed as well as your tailgate. Now, as you can see on your rear bumper, you have the rear uh, bumper step, which makes things a little bit easier for you when you're getting into the back of the bed. You'll find your connectors just located in the center there. You also have your rear uh, bed step on your right-hand side as well. The spare tire will be located underneath your bumper, and then you have the backup camera as well as the lock for it. Now, as you can see, it's actually padded up in the back here, which makes things a little bit easier for you, especially when you have cargo in the back here. So instead of damaging your bed, it's just going to damage this uh, um, cover that it's placed in the uh, back of the bed here. Now, the other nice thing is that you can actually place uh, items on the back here without fear of them getting wet, because you do have the hard tonneau cover on the back here. So in the event that you do have some cargo that sits up a little bit higher, you can have this folded up at the very front there for yourself as well. And then you have a couple of areas located on the left, right, front, and back side where you can tie down some loose cargo, just so it's not shifting around in the back of your bed just while you're driving. Thank you so much, folks, for watching this video today. If you have any questions, please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Phone number is 780-410-2455, or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. Once again, folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comments section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day, and I hope to see you next time.